Hey guys, welcome back to Into the Canyon. It's Ranger Olivia. So today's episode is going to be extra special. We're going on a road trip. So I'm going to go meet up with all the other interpreters in our region, Region 2, and we're going to Powderhorn State Park. So let's go. So Powderhorn State Park is only about two and a half hours away from Choke Canyon. Uh, but once I got there, I met up with all the other interpreters here at the ranch house. And we do this once every few months where all of us interpreters in Region 2 gather to exchange resources and see how we're doing and talk about our experiences at our parks at the moment. And after we're done with the meetings, we go out and explore whichever state park we're staying in. And uh, this time it was extra special because Powderhorn State Park is not yet open to the public. And so we're one of the first groups to see the property as a state park. And so we were able to explore like these cool saltwater marshes and all the wetlands that are on the property to these beautiful sandbars that were just absolutely teeming with life all the way to the sandbar deer that are native to India and Southeast Asia. I even found one of their sheds laying on the ground, so that was really cool. And then touch me nuts are always a fun find. And there were crabs everywhere. So we have this fiddler crab, this angry blue crab, and then we have more hermit crabs than I could count. This is only a small sampling of what I found. I really had to watch my stuff when I was walking around in the sandbars, but this was really, really fun. And once I was done looking at them, I put them all back in the water where I found them. And uh, they're just all over the place, like this little group right here. And no state park experience is complete without staying the night in a tent. So now you're probably wondering when is this park gonna open? So we bought this park back in 2020 and uh, we're trying to gear it up to open it up to the public. Now it's gonna take some time, but the uh, estimated date is around uh, 2029. Uh, so it's, it's a while, but it takes a lot of time to build a park, all the infrastructure and all that. And so um, that's the reason for the lease date. Now we're really looking forward to it. We can't wait to open it.